What's he looking at? Oh, it's an Imperial Star Destroyer. I, I like that this destroyer looks like it's on its last leg. The sequels tried saying the First Order was a, a remnant of the Empire, but they it looked like they got newly pristine ships and uniforms straight out of an iPhone store. You see, these troopers are what a remnant should look like. Whoa, who's this guy? Gold member from the Austin Power movies? <laughs> oh, wizard. Here is Timothy Zahn's OG character, Mr. Thrawn. I believe the first book Thrawn appeared in was called Heir to the Empire. Mm. Honestly, the only reason why I, I read the books was because I had the hots for Ms. Mara Jade. Here he is. What was first just a dream has become a Oh my god, for a second I thought I was looking at a blue-faced Elon Musk. <laughs> hey, looks like the Admiral hasn't been holding back on his full course meals. He's got the body shape of Stalin. What does his daily meals consist of? Non-stop baby back ribs with a side of chicken nuggets? I felt... You know, in the books, Thrawn teamed up with an ex-Jedi, I believe, called Joris K. Booth or Caboose. Looks like that's what the Admiral is doing now. It's interesting Kathleen said there was no source material, but she keeps recycling the stories of the old expanded universe, but just making them worse. Long ago, you would uh, One thing I don't see from the books is Thrawn having one of those lizard things on his shoulders that repels the force. I think they were called Yaslamari, um, or were they called Calamari? You know what? He probably did have those lizards, but he just ate them all. <laughs> Thank you for watching my AI reaction. If you'd like to see me react to that loser Ezra coming back, let me know. Okay, I gotta go send Disney more hate mail. Bye.